What's going on guys, T-Mart here, and today we are going to be talking about a potential new weapon coming to Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. So, we've been hearing about a lot of stuff on the way to Advanced Warfare recently. First and foremost, there's the M1 Irons. It's some sort of DLC weapon. We're not sure what it's going to be yet. Could be a pistol, could be a rifle, could be an SMG, but Kaj has been, you know, tweeting about it, teasing it, stuff like that. That thing's going to be coming soon. We've also found out that there are going to be new elite versions of weapons coming to the game. There's a new AK-12 Hall of Fame that's definitely going to be coming and most likely some other elite variants as well which uh, would be pretty cool and, and then now finally yesterday Michael Condry actually tweeted about a new one so check out this tweet right here he said SAC 1.5 question mark and obviously a lot of people were really excited about this and uh, the direction I think he's going with this is think about the SAC 3 SMG in Advanced Warfare. You guys know that's the, you know, dual-handed akimbo weapon you run around with. It's not the most effective thing in the world, but it is fun to use. It's fun to mess around with. It's something different, and it's kind of unique to Advanced Warfare. Now, uh, those are the SAC 3s. What does SAC 1.5 mean? Obviously, 1.5 is half of 3, which I'm thinking means it's just going to be one of those weapons. So it's going to be a single SAC weapon that you can like use like a normal SMG and run around with, aim down sight, that kind of thing. It's not going to be a Kimbo anymore, which would be kind of cool. Now, I was looking at this image right here, and I was thinking, like, what does this look like? This looks really, really familiar. Well, take a look at an image of a Vector. We've seen the Vector in a couple previous Call of Duty games, and obviously, it's a very good SMG. It was especially good in Ghosts and stuff like that, so it'd be kind of cool to see that return. So, I'm not sure if this is going to be like a, a totally new weapon that comes back and it, it's kind of exclusive to itself, or this could be the third Elite variant of the SAC 3s. Like, what if this is a special variant that actually, instead of being an Akimbo weapon, it kind of took it down to one, and that was like one of its defining characteristics. I think that would be kind of cool for them to do. So, uh, yeah, there you guys have it. There's some sort of SAC 1.5 that may or may not be coming to advanced warfare i'm thinking you know leaning more towards may because he wouldn't tweet that out otherwise so, uh, so that's kind of cool. So yeah, I, just, I think it's awesome. I, I think they're really mixing up. I, I think, you know, this late in the game, like we're, we're getting into late April, early May. Everybody's excited about Black Ops 3 at this point. But they are giving us all kinds of stuff to keep us kind of interested in and at least hold us over until November comes around, which I really like. I think they're doing a great job with it so far. So, uh, yeah, I want what you guys think about a Vector or a SAC 1.5 coming to Advanced Warfare. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys check out these two videos on the screen if you haven't seen yet. And I will catch you guys later. Peace out.